Go, Go Wolves! Wolves. All right, good morning. Good Welcome morning. to Cedar Park High School. Yes. This is all new. Everything up front is new renovation. Okay. So everything from here up was part of that last bond package. So they did the secure vestibules and they redid the entire front office. I'm going to take you out to the courtyard and okay. we'll just get kind of a lay of the land of what wow. the whole building design looks like. This is our science building here on the left. Okay. And then on the west side of the courtyard, that's where all of our CTE programs are. Oh, okay. Let's go stop in and see what's going on in the band world today. Yes, sounds good to me. Our band program is the reigning three-time yep. UIL state marching champions. So oh, pretty, I know. pretty amazing what they've accomplished. Do you want to stop by and yes. see what choir's doing? Yes, absolutely. Hi, here this is our amazing choir directors and some Hello. choir students that have been recognized man last year as the top 5A choir in the state of Texas. <laughs> this is our one of our PE classes here. Let's go in and say hello to this group. Coach Ott is a coach of our state championship girls basketball team. Yes, ma'am. What so an awesome. experience. Like that's one thing I'm like I keep taking away on this visit is all of these opportunities that these students are having that are positive in this COVID environment and just you guys are making them happen for yeah, them. Like, I think that's the big thing, just seeing that we were in the midst of all this yes. around us. That, uh, and then I didn't realize that it had never been done in the band ISD. I mean, I, I, I knew Cedar Park at that, but I didn't know that it was a whole. So it really means a lot to uh, me personally and to our yes, kids it's huge. to give something to not just Cedar Park, but the whole district, the LISD. Yeah, I agree. And, uh, it, and so it's special for sure. Yes. We have a full. Oh my goodness, this is yes. amazing. Full kitchen, full professional kitchen. So when students who take this, um, just give it, they prepare them, you know, they could have a job afterwards. Like what is this? Yeah, they get here? some certifications Man, and then. I'm like, I want to go cooking in here right now. <laughs> <laughs> We are back towards the main office yes. up there. This is the west side of the main building. We're gonna go upstairs and see some broadcasts. So, Mr. Garcia is actually out today, but I really just want you to see the studio. And this piece was actually donated. And so Anthony got a crew together. They went and picked it up and they pulled it in and, and they got the, actually got the, the building trades group to help with some of the construction pieces and cutting it down. And oh, that is amazing. Work, so. Okay, that's yeah, really cool. It's pretty cool. Today, my visit to Cedar Park High School was extraordinary. What I saw was a community come together during this crazy time and find ways to truly inspire children, whether it's from our CTE programs, our fine arts programs, our band program, and even our athletic program. This campus has truly found a way to embrace our students during COVID, and I'm just truly excited to see and feel this energy as soon as I step on campus. The students at Cedar Park High School continue to show resilience and grit during this uncertain time. I'd like to give a shout out to our Lady Timberwolves for winning the state championship, a first in history for Leander ISD. Go Timberwolves! 